Hello and welcome back to another housing video for patch 6.4 Final Fantasy 14 with me, Mioni. Today we're looking at a Crystarium piece and this is in particular a light fixture. There's a lot of Crystarium themed crafted items for housing already in the game. This is the Crystarium bench, for example. We have stuff like the Crystarium wardrobe with the crystals aligned on that. We've got a Crystarium teapot. We've got a Crystarium umbrella stand. We have the Crystarium stove and fixtures. Sort of to give that idea. There isn't a lot of items, but there are enough to kind of decorate a space. But one of the items I've been looking forward to looking at is, of course, this. The Crystarium Pendant Wall Light. So when you walk around the actual Crystarium in Shadowbringers, uh, you'll probably notice these quite often. And as you can see, it says a wall-mounted trio of hanging lamps crafted in the Crystarium style. This is a level 90 basic goldsmithing recipe. My goldsmith's not high enough, so I purchased this from a market board today. It uses two of the blue spirit tiles, three of the bismuth ingots, three crystal glass, and three tallow candles, so really not that bad. And this is what it looks like. So we're in our apartment today, like in one of the other videos that's also gone out today, um, because I thought it would be nice to look at this. So this is quite a large item, as you can see, and the way that it mounts is directly from the point that you place it so it is a horizontal placement item uh, let's just place this over this bench for a second we'll move the bench over there just temporarily so this is what the item fully looks like and as you can see you've got something sticking out of the wall and then there are these baubles can we call them baubles i think that's fair to call them that um sticking out so if you want to have some nice big glowy balls there are probably less enjoyable balls you can place into your house. I quite like the light that comes from this. Um, I was surprised at how bright these are, but they're soft, sort of like cold light, but it's soft cold light. It's not bright, it's horrible. You know, not like kind of nasty stuff. Also, it's rare for a light fitting to sort of stick out like that. We have other fixtures, wall fixtures, that sort of are like um, uh, wind chimes and things like that, that follow this kind of thing but not that many light fixtures i also like the polygonal mount on the wall there as well that metal that wrought iron uh, with that black coloration but unfortunately this item is not dyeable i would have loved to have changed the stained glass to a different color or something that would have been a really really nice feature but unfortunately that was not something that, uh, that was included with this model. Let's have a look what it looks like in different light settings then. Um, we've got our candles to the left here, but that shouldn't be too problematic. Slightly dimmed then, looks looking quite nice on a three there. And when we go down to zero light. Yeah, I think those are quite nice actually. They put out this sort of slight glow, but not a lot. As you can see, it's a lot of blue light. So yeah, the light they produce is this sort of soft, not too sharp, um, sort of white and blue light, as you would expect from the blue of the actual stained glass. Yeah, it would have been really nice to be able to dye these, wouldn't it? But um, yeah, that might be beyond the capabilities. Even if it was just the metal itself that would have been dyeable, that would have been lovely. But yeah, this is a really, really nice item. And especially if you wanted to have some lighting that sort of came out of a wall, and you don't want to necessarily have something that looks like a wind chime or, you know, freestanding stuff. It is always nice to have more stuff like this. So, yeah, I'm very pleased with those. Very pleased indeed. Let me know what you think about these. I think that they're easily accessible. A lot of people have been making gill all uh, for the last couple of weeks on these. Um, very easy craft. But, yeah, actually quite nice. I do hope they do some Crystarium themed walls and things soon. We have like similar like crystal wall features but they are not Crystarium. The sooner we can make our entire house look like big stained glass walls and stuff like that, the sooner I will have realized my dream personally. Anyway, much love. Enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.